previously on Control. That was Artie's vacation spot. Let's see if it still plays the tango on the way down. Nope, it doesn't. So that etching is the door. Okay, let's try opening it. The floors crawl, the walls slither, it's a shifting pit. The very bottom of the oldest house. Director access only. She was on the hotline, so that person couldn't have been Marshall, right? Let's see what's going on with that pillar first. And now, the actual oh. video. Look at- wow, oh, look at that, dude. Look at all that foundation, man. Gosh, damn. Okay, so there looks like there's a couple of roots out here, actually. Like, there's a way up, definitely a way up there. Uh, there's obviously also the way down there to the base camp that, um, we saw. Okay, let's, let's go this way and see what's what. So what's over here. A box. Awesome. Uh, that is a mod. Oh, so this is the warehouse path. Alright, so looks like we're going to the warehouse path first then. That's fine. Me being my melee. Uh, oh. Well, um, problem number one, the, uh, the warehouse is being blocked by rocks. Looks like I can't go this way just yet. Oh well, looks like I need to get to the base camp first then. That's fine. Oh, I'm assuming... That huge shaft of light is probably where the nail is supposed to go to stabilize the rest of this damn place. Oh no! Okay, I made it back into- Okay, I, I made it onto solid ground. Damn, I missed the jump. Okay, so- Ooh, there's a thing over there, a file of some kind. Oops. Yep, it's a file. Let's, uh, let's pick it up and read it. Foundation Pillar. The pillar found at the crossroads is best described as an onyx spike that protrudes from the cave floor like an imposing stalagmite. Despite its aggressive silhouette, the structure has an undeniable allure. Freud would certainly have something to say about the pillar's overly erect nature, but I'm drawn more to Whitner's, Whitmore's essay on dynamic layers, structures within structures, the fractal mirror in every being. Uh, given its significant location, I believe the pillar is either the very heart of the oldest house or an intrusion within that heart. Or perhaps it's like the husk of a seed from which the oldest house sprouted. Trottier wrote that great architect is, architecture isn't built, it grows. But then why does the pillar look so different from the rest of this place's concrete walls and rocky caverns? It's easy to see it as an anomaly, a buried artifact. A foreign body. A, a, a demonic phallus. I wonder if this pillar is any, any more welcome here than we are. Uh, there's another document here that I haven't read yet. Apparently, where is it? Astral copy. With the astral plane now physically accessible, a torrent of new information has been collected on the entities known as astral copies. The copies' bodies are composed of a dense stone-like material that is both resilient. Whether the astral copies possess individual consciousness, or most of the environment is unknown. Director Vader's encounter with these entities from binding officers of the Prime blah, 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 blah. Live targets for potential para utilitarians. Be immune to his corruption. Sweet. Ooh, a new hotline entry. Rituals. I have not seen this before. Uh, this. Let's uh, let's have a look. No. Oh. So these locks or keys or whatever it is we're finding, they help, I guess, ground the board or the house into reality or something? I don't know. Well, whatever it is, it appears they are integral to our journey as directors, so... Uh, I'm assuming I don't have to go down there. I, don't, I, don't, I assume base camp is not down this way. Actually, let's head down. Oh, ooh, box. Okay, that's a mod, obviously. No, if there's anything down here, although there are ramps that allude to something being down here. Another box, obviously. I can't actually see in this. I don't have a flashlight or anything. All I have is... Uh, this This section of wall looks very different. I wonder why. I don't know if there's anything down here, though, so... I guess we came, just came down here to pick up two boxes and that was it. <laughs> is a level 6 mod. A Pierce Zoom Boost. Okay, so it looks like to reach the base camp, we need to extrude a series of those crystals along the wall and just keep hopping along them and hope and pray we don't fall off and die. I'm assuming, I'm assuming the people around here probably found this or had access to these crystals before they all, I don't know, retracted into the wall or something. Ugh. And 
And I'm assuming this cave also probably used to be a lot bigger and it had more structures. I just... Than, than just shelves of crystal, you know what I mean? Uh, oh, this is the only one. Okay. Oh! Wait, I hear- uh, I hear gunfire. Yeah, I know, dude. Yeah, it sucks. Whoops, that's all I meant to do. Hey, you, work for me. There you go. Alright, what the hell was that about? It looks like these constructs, these floating things, are also like not aligned with the hiss. Because the, 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 the hiss guy was trying to kill it. And so it leads me to believe that maybe these things are like representative of like the board or the actual plane in some way? I don't know. That is not what I'm going to do at all. Going. I was wondering why I was hearing gunfire now. Oh, hi! They have this! Uh, hey, suicide guy, work for me! Thank you! Ow! Oh, that hurt! Stop throwing things at me! Explode! Dead. Well, okay then, that was strange and also weird. I am happy to hear that. Looks like the hiss are. Looks like the hiss are also, uh. Not happy with some of the things around, things around here. Ooh, that's a level 9, dude. We have another one of those. Oops. Here. Oop. Oop, I'm out of cover. Stand here, let my focus recharge for a little bit. The focus being the white bar at the top of your screen. You're a big boy! Oops. Hey, you gonna come down here and fight me like a man? Or, uh. Socializing less these days, most things goes. Yeah, I, yeah, I get that. It's because of oh, it's because of the whole quarantine business. I get that totally. Don't you? <laughs> hey, you here? Um, have this rock. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, you do that. I'm just gonna quickly switch weapons. Hold on a second. I'm gonna switch from shatter to pierce. So basically, this is a sniper rifle or or a real gun, as I like to call it. Uh. And what it does is it, it, it chews through most of it very, very well. I'm just gonna continue lobbing rocks at this guy until he dies. At least he comes out, at least until he comes out of hiding. Come back, come out here, you coward. Oh, I see my enemies back there, actually. Oh! And he's dead. Sweet. Okay, so I, I, I see, I saw a couple more enemies past that wall there, so we're gonna deal with those guys in due time, but until then... Oh my god! Ah, my face! Who did that? I want to know who was responsible for that travesty. Oh, it's you. Thank you. Oh, they're in the air! That's what I've been missing. Here, have one of those. Okay. Oh, those things are bombs. Good to know. It appears there's a box up there. I'm guessing if I had taken like destroy power, I would be able to destroy those, but oh well. Uh, where am I? The Fracture Cavern. A stag. Huh, <laughs> wait. What's it called? Joe's Stag. These are like, uh, like caterpillar. This area looks newer. Is it from the upper floors? Oops. Yeah. Yep. Oh, well, this looks part of the, um, this looks part of the bureau. It really looks like it's part of the bureau. Contain the ritual in the collapsed department. Oh, complete rather, not contain. Duh. De oh! Dude, what happened to the fire break here? Jeez. So much corrupted. So much hiss. 
Jeez. There's something behind that his barrier. That looks like a big pile of crystals to me. So let's fly over there and see what's what. So uh, for those of you that don't know, this is the fire break. A the fire break is an area that contains well, I mean that separates uh, parts of the oldest house. <laughs> I'm assuming this particular part of the fire break got this way because, I don't know, the oldest house shifted or something? I'm not too sure. This this whole game is weird, you know what I mean? Also, hey, there's the uh, the lucky cat that we saw in the trailer for this DLC. We see a control point past this wall. Data entry and filing. So this is, so this is the department that we're in, huh? Just claim this. Federal Bureau of Control. I wonder what that is. I wonder what this is. Who are these people? What is that thing? So looks like we can't get in through the front door. Or we, get, or we can uh, get it through here. <laughs> so let's read this. Shift accounts, part one. To whoever finds this, I am containment processes designer Jian Gibbs, and I'm writing this to document the largest building shifts to ever occur. Here are the facts. A considerable, considerably large section of the containment sector, including the processes and protocols offices, our research facilities, and a fair chunk of the firebreak has been yanked down to a chasm that reaches far below lobby level. It was a violent shift and regrets report several casualties. Injuries are sustained by all, but many of us, myself included, are still mobile. Uh, we set up a, we've set up a base camp and started triaging. There are little supplies. We've explored our surroundings and found caverns of all things. Maybe we're in some kind of cave threshold like the quarry. Uh, wh wherever we are, we are, we are not the first. There's some rusty power cores, old lights, signs, infrastructure. What was this area used for? Why did they seal it off? Why have you never heard of it? More importantly, how are we going to get out? Well, I'm assuming that the source of these old like power cores and other equipment is probably the old people that the old bureau people that were in the uh, oldest house uh, that started that uh, found this place before the current bureau, the current generation bureau. Whoops. Yeah, I'm assuming this will help me unlock the door. Oh, cool. Hi, what's this? Kiev. Where is this place? A, a series of reverberating sounds observed in downtown Kiev, the nuclear point of origin. This is a city's general public. Mental and physical symptoms reported, including aphasia, sleep paralysis, and excess something in the reported individuals. Due to the brief age of the event, overseas bureau agents are not able to respond while it was active. Immediately upon arrival, under courtesy of local witnesses, all bureau monitoring stations located at global junctions of acoustic amplification. Following these similar cases were reported from both amateur, various amateur sources and bureau stations in major cities around the globe. The event is believed to be generated by planar friction, though this is not confirmed. So it's like a great... No, 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 not Kiev. It's a, it's a Kai, K-Y-I-V. Hold on, let me, let, me, let me go back to that document again. Is this Kiev or, or is this some other city? K-Y-I-V. Not sure. Let me look it up really quick. K-Y-I-V. Oh, it is Kiev. You're right, actually, Rob. You are right. So that's actually Kiev. But what happened in Kiev? Was this some of like great metaphysical earthquake or something? I don't know. It's a uh, nice painting. Ooh. Okay, this, this warrants another photo. Hold on. So what is this? Oh, yep. Yep, screw that, the hits are here. Actually, hold on a second. Hey, you, come here. I need a friend. Thank you. Now, could you please help me murder the other, the other hiss, 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 hiss infected your personnel that are in here? I should probably be swapping to my sniper rifle for this. Dang it, I missed. Uh, have that. Oh, did, oh man. The object ran out of the object ran out of momentum before it even hit him. You have one of those. Hey, you work for me now. Help us fine with you because you have grenades. Oh my god, it's these things, the floaters that, that the floaters that throw things at people. Stop it. Shoot. Come on, come on, gun, recharge. Thank you. Oh 
Here, have those. Have that. <laughs> hey, as much as you're like weird. Oh. As much as you're like weird and floaty and gross, I kind of want you to be my friend. Can you do that for me, please? Thank you. Now they're just gonna just throw stuff at each other. Hey, uh, yeah, you two. There's a, there's a guy, there's a couple of guys over there that I want you to help me take care of, please. Thank you. Deal with them. Oh, there's a big guy over there. You have one of those. Table! Oops. Shark! Friggin' snipers. Here, mine now, clown. Uh. Yeah, go, go, go have a nice, good, long fight with your friend over there. Thank you. Woo. Okay, that's not what I meant to do. Hi! Whoops. There's another dude over here down below. Oh, no, no he's up here. No, th no, thank you. I bid you farewell. I think the, the big... Stop. Cease. Jeez, Louise. Any more? Yeah, that, that, that big sniper, that, the big sniper dude is still alive. Here, have a fire extinguisher. Is he dead? Yeah, I think he's dead. There's, there, there, are more, there are bound to be more enemies around here, though. I know it. I can smell them in the air. Uh... Oh, hi! Ow! Wow! Rude! Freaking asshole! Okay, this well, that this is a poor state for all. This is a poor state for all these people. They got shoved away in some sort of building shift, and then all of them got taken over by the hiss. That's depressing, actually. It's very depressing. And hey, for like whoever is left, you probably just put them out of their misery. So you know, at least um, they'll be resting in peace now. I assume I gotta go through here because that's where the big bright light was. Okay, there's usually something bad, or there's always something bad hiding in these. Bah. <laughs> Someone call a plumber. Glad no one's around to hear that. Jesse. <laughs> Jerk. So that's interesting. Oh, look, dude, look at that. How are they, how do they do this? I, I can, ow. I can climb on top of it and everything, but when I go back, it's the, 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 it's the back of the building. I'm just gonna quickly take a picture of this fucked up bathroom. Hold on. Oh, looks like this bathroom's, looks like this bathroom is relatively normal. All right, let's get through this, oh, hold on. The evaluation hall is this way. Uh, any tapes, documents here? No? Okay, so there was a document that I just got just now that I couldn't read because the freaking flying stone person tried to attack me. Computer program. Dead letters. Ooh. Dear House of Representatives, my husband, Francis, read an article before he died about how the universe was really just a computer program. He believed it. I thought it sounded silly, but now I think he was right. Francis was hit by a car a few months ago. A drunk driver. And I don't think it was supposed to happen. My neighbor's son Jeremy broke one of our windows with a football a week before Francis died. Francis yelled at Jimmy for it. He was a bit harsh. This is important because I see Jeremy on his computer through the living, their living room window. He's on it all the time. His mother says he's a computer whiz. I think Jeremy is operating the computer program and he changed the universe so that the driver would hit Francis. He did it to get back at Francis for yelling at him. Is there a way to change the computer and make Francis come back? I have some money if it's expensive. I don't know how these things work. I don't care if Jeremy gets in trouble or not. I just want Francis to come home. Francis and I were very happy together. I can feel him not being here and I know it's not right. Sincerely, Stephanie Miller. Ooh, that uh, poses a lot more questions than answers now, don't you think? And... 
another broken bridge. Wonderful. Oh, there's bureau agents here too. Look, there's, there's, there's bureau agents here. Ah. Oh. Put them out of their misery. You can't live like that, being brainwashed by a hostile frequency of all things. This living in that existence would be harsh. Ooh. Oh, okay, though this demands a picture. I just love looking into games like this. It's so gorgeous. Every set piece is so intricately detailed. Also, that's a mod that I don't think I have space for. Yeah, but I don't, don't need it anyway. Looks like the security cameras are still up and someone's still watching me, I think. Yeah, these are bathrooms. Nothing in here. Oh, sometimes I, I have found I have found bad guys in bathrooms. Also rocks. Uh, I see a control point through that window, that door. Uh, what else is in here? So I might have to come through something else later. But for now, looks like I just have to go through. Oops. Yeah, it looks like yeah, that's a control point just through this wall, which means checkpoint. Yeah, it's a shelter in here too. Oh, let's like quickly claim this. How far are you into this game? This is actually past the um, the end of the main game, uh, Rob. This is actually the uh, DLC that just released for this game yesterday. Uh, oh, I don't. Yep, I can't do anything about this, unfortunately. Uh, I've actually finished this game already, and the whole reason why I'm playing it again is because the DLC. This is actually DLC that just released for it too. Because then we can open both doors. Get this box. Uh, that is a mod. What is it for? Explosive ammo refund. Uh, another, oh, a supplement for Kiev. Uh, recordings of the audio phenomena were uploaded onto the internet shortly after the event. These records, these records circulated rapidly on popular message boards. The communications department utilized this exposure by creating the Sky Pup Trumpet hoax videos. <gasps> Oh, dude, dude, we have an explanation for the sky trumpet noise, the, 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 the sky trumpet things. I remember this. I remember reading about it on Cracked or I think on, on seeing it on YouTube. There was this big whole hoo-ha some years ago about noises, you know, strange, uh, deep, loud trumpet. No, 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 trumpet more like like drilling humming sort of noises in the air this was a couple of years ago i think yeah it's definitely in kiev among other places uh industrial uh sky trumpet hoax videos and posting rel related theories to spread confusion and draw attention away from the event's paranormal origin industrial noise particularly the sound of metal drilling was found to be a widely accepted explanation theories about the sounds emanating from the earth itself known as seismic hum emerged from the public itself and encouraged by the bureau to generate further restoration and eventual public disinterest witnesses of the events were monitored discreetly afterwards observed symptoms symptoms were considered were consistent with something deprivation but subsided after 12 to 15 days the length of the symptoms directly correlated to the individual's proximity unsheltered to the supposed epicenter one linked although accidental casualty can be listed series of report read the effects of plain artificial on hearing aids oh that's kind of sad <laughs> okay so there has to be other things inside this office right yep a tape awesome you're listening to America Overnight, a beacon in the darkest recesses of possibility for more than 29 years. We have another letter from a listener. This one's unsigned, but postmarked from Toledo. It says, Dear America Overnight, I have the most wonderful appliance for your listeners. It is a miracle of God. A fondue set. A fountain. A blessed gift. Blessed is spelled with a capital B. Hmm. Go on, they write. Dive on in. It is molten hot. Perfect for meat. No signature. As far as I know, no fondue set was sent to us here at the studio. Just this letter. Wait. I think there's something else in the envelope. Some kind of black powder. With white shards in it. Bone, maybe? Karen. What is this? Karen? We're on the air, Karen. Where are we? What? What's this powder in the booth? Is this... Is this ash? Oh. Oh, God. Karen? How do I cut to commercial? <laughs> I... What? What? <laughs> what? Uh, ooh, another document. What is this? Shift account part two. Uh, Gibbs reporting in. It has been eight days since the collapse and still no sign of any rescue efforts. The Bureau is either complete, completely unaware of our situation or are incapable of helping us. Or maybe it's intentional. 
How many times have you seen the Bureau not give two shits about his own hardworking staff when they go missing in this place? How many times do we let it slide thinking, oh, at least it wasn't me? Too many, I'm ashamed to admit. Oops. In the way. Anyway, there have been some developments. Strange crystals have been growing through the begun growing through the walls. They seem to block some corridors, but not others. The path to the caves is always left open, but we're not sure why. Luckily, the kiss the, cri the crystals the crystals keep out the astral spike. One's been hounding us for days. John, Nicolay, and Sarah went to try and find a radio, but never came back. We think the spike got them. I think it's hunting us. Doug says spikes only exist in the astral plane, so what the fuck is it doing out here? If we get out of here, I'm hiring a lawyer. These are unsuitable working conditions. Astral spikes? Oh, do you mean, um, uh, the, um, do I have it here? No, I don't. Okay, so, if I'm not wrong, these astral spikes are these weird ball-shaped things. They're like very angry geometric shapes. They're invincible and they I can't damage them in any way, so the most I can do is just run away from them. So, uh, I guess this is the uh, gate to the uh, evaluation hall. Well, something bad happened here. Uh, this, this, I hate this place. They say this as an action game, but this is more horror than anything else. I'm scared. I'm deeply scared. <laughs> because let's quickly swap over to Shatter because it's my shotgun. Because whatever is here, I don't want to it within two feet of my face without some form of buckshot between me and it. <laughs> well, like, can I press this button to... Warning. Altered item detected in transport bay. Ooh. Access is prohibited for safety regulation 18.A. Okay, so I can't go in there because there's uh there's some bad juju in that room, so I guess I have to bypass it somehow. Like this, I guess. Take this lift to go. Uh, what? So that's the altered item. Looks pretty secure. So the altered item is a movie projector? It's a film projector? Well, so why wasn't the, why was the PA not letting me go through the... Okay, hold on. Let's have a... Let's press this and see what happens. No power. Typical. No, no power. Typical. I swear, if something jumps out at me, I have a shotgun. I should hire someone who builds smaller machines. <laughs> I mean, it's not your... It's kind of not your fault that um these buildings were made this way, you know? Oh, that's not what I meant to do. That's not what I meant to do either. Put those doors down. Uh, grab that. Get out of the way. It's supposed to be power cores in here, but... Oh, there they are. Okay, uh... I need to find... Okay, hold on. Let me just put this down. Oops. Oh, no, there's a lot... There are a lot of them. Oh, yeah, that's a... Oh, okay. Let's look at... I'm just... I'm just... I'm just sort of, sort of wrecking everything, to be honest. And down it goes. <laughs> they're, they're, they're all just falling to the ground behind me. Okay, so I guess I'm supposed to yeet the power points into those holes. Like that. Okay. Oops. Out of... Out of... I don't know, it's... I don't know, Rob. I don't know which SCP this is. Resume altered item transport at designated terminal. Okay, so this item is being transported somewhere before the building shift. What the... Okay, there it's going, I guess. Don't know what it does or actually I don't think I want to know what it does. It's probably like it's probably like the slide projector that opens up a portal to some weird ass dimension. Oh, it's gone now. Oh okay, so now I can just go back out but go back out slash down and then Okay, hold on. Before I move on, I'm just gonna turn up the brightness because oh my god, I'm scared out of my mind. I'm putting on an air of emotional and mental stability when in actual fact I'm terrified. I am very scared. Very, very scared. <laughs> Just quickly save. No altered material detected in area. Personnel may now safely enter. Have a bureau full day. <sighs> what? Um, notes itself, whoever made that assign uh, announcement, can I please fire them? <laughs> hey, you, work for me. You too. Yep. Oops. Let me know what you think of the stereo, not a real artist. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll take a look once I'm done reading up these guys. Here, have this. Oh, it's a big dude. It's a big dude. It's a big dude. How are you not dead? Okay, here, you my friend. 
tried to make it a little sketchy on purpose. All right. Um, what am I? What am I holding? I don't know. <laughs> Oops, that's what I meant to do. Hey. Hey. You know, I, I'd like to have you as a friend, so uh, if you don't mind. Thank you. Oh, that was all the combat that was, huh? Eh, yeah, that's okay. I get it. Well, at least this guy won't um, harass me anymore, I guess. <gasps> Damn. Get up there, Jesse. Because I need to get over there, but the problem is, um, most of the office is logged? Question mark? Uh, what was I, what was I supposed to go in here for, go in here for anyway? Uh, oh, I think the big guy is dead. Yep, the big guy is dead. Oh well. Uh, if only it would help me figure out what the hell I'm supposed to do here, because I am lost. Just trying to figure out what the hell I'm supposed to do here. Uh, this game doesn't really give you a lot of, like, hints or and or directions, so. Wait, hold on. Yeah, yeah, I was right. So transit access is that way. This, I'm betting, leads to that locked door. Yep. Oh, more red sand, more rocks, and open door. Sweet. Okay, so where does this go? Ah, okay, so hold on. Uh, that means this down here should lead to transit access. The same transit access. Where does this go? Properly trained. I guess I pass. I am very properly trained. I think this is progress. Although I'm not sure whether or not um, this is progress or the other area above us was progress. Hold on, let me... There's so much to do in this game. It's another elevator. That looks like soap or mold. Yep, it's mold. Can you... Die, please. Oops. Yeah, you belong in the corner. Bad mold object. Bad. New language. It's a dead letter. Yep. For immediate publication, I learned a new language. The fish taught me. You probably don't believe me, so I will prove it. Oops. Damn. Uh. Gibberish. Wait. Hold on. Let me let me pronounce this as best as I can, and and hope I don't summon some sort of eldritch god in the process. Whole lil miuti jer milu abd use ueman eko guido kib or or this sounds like this sounds like elite talk to me honest. publish this letter and maybe other fish speakers will get in touch to be able to read my address even if you can't jemni rog larry humbert uh oh well bathrooms full of rocks guys <laughs> notice security checkpoints all persons and property are subject to search oh this one leads to the fire break hey fair enough uh it's film reels looks like a bunch of computers another box so it looks like both the elevator back down that way and this place are also progress. Movie camera supplement. Oh, that's the movie camera that we just saw. Uh, let's look at this. The, the item came to first came to the Bureau's attention after a hospitalized mailman from, from Blank, Arkansas claimed his injuries had been caused by a movie camera. For the investigation, connected the incident to altered item 80, which was being shipped in the mail truck at the time. Packaged camera was later found in an empty warehouse. The return address that's the agents to a PO box located in the San Fernando Valley belonging to a company called Blessed Pictures. Uh, whether Blessed Pictures is involved in the creation and dissemination of the item's VHS films is unknown. The following list is the following is a list of all known films believed to have been shot by the Action Max camera. Shoot first, die last, unreleased. Uh, footnote: Item was used in the filming of an unreleased western in 1968 on the Italian island of Sardinia. A cast member was killed on a, during an on-site accident, stopping production. It is believed that Blessed Pictures brought the camera when it bought the camera when equipment from the shoot was sold at an auction. Uh, Coffee Bullet released the first. Car by car delivery disaster acquisition date the 9th uh, 14th of September 2016. Contain location in transit. Yeah, it is in transit. It's like down below us. <laughs> okay, what's this? Shift account part three. It's clear no one is coming. We're running out of ideas and supplies. We've tried going to the caves to find anything edible, but all we found were noxious gas and endless pits. The crystals only let us go one way, even though we could see the caves branched out. We did find some weird spiky pillar. I only got a glimpse of it before the astral spikes attacked. There were a few of them this time. We lost a lot of people. There's only six of us left. We didn't ask for this. We didn't want to come down here. I'm convinced something brought brought us down here. The others sound going nuts, but it's clear that this is no house shift. Shifts slide a bathroom a sector over or rotate a hallway. They don't drop full division into some caves. We were brought here, I know it. But for what? Why tear us away from our lives just to torture us? If this is some sort of test or mission, then here's some advice for whoever's running it. Give out clearer instructions next time. I hope these notes are a good read for whatever ranger finds them. Fuck you. Put that in your report. 
Gibbs. It is an SCP game without being it being explicitly or overtly about the uh, SCP Foundation. But um, we deal we do deal with the mysterious Federal Bureau of Control who exists in a strange uh, otherworldly skyscraper located in the center of New York City that no one has ever seen and no one and that no one can see because of a strange perception filter that's around it. The building exists, but you can't see it until it either chooses to let you see it or you find out about its existence. <laughs>